This type of connection is called bridging. It's done by cutting a whole row in one pass. Right now, we're only cutting halfway. Why? Because if we cut all the way to the end, the filming would affect the video quality and you wouldn't be able to see clearly. So for this video, we're demonstrating bridging in two cuts. The key to bridging is the bridge width. If the bridge is too narrow, it breaks off too soon. If it's too wide, the pieces stay connected. As long as after cutting, the sections fall off one by one, that means it's successful, no damage, and that's the best result. Some people ask, did you leave too much on the plate edge? What if the plate tilts and you can't cut all the way to the end? In fact, if the pattern extends too far, it can't be seen clearly anyway, so we just return from there. You can see here, as we cut across, the piece drops off right at the end, it falls away. That shows the bridge width was just right. Also, when moving along, the cut stays smooth and doesn't break the process. If you don't know how to use this continuous cutting method or how to handle panels, then subscribe to Weld Mastering DIA1 for professional cutting training, specializing in material programming and cutting instruction.